What's good dolls? Welcome back to the YouTube channel. It's your girl Kayla Lachey and today we are doing a healthy vlog. Your girl needs to get back on track with healthy eating and just having things prepped and ready in the fridge. So I'm going to show you guys in this video today some meal prep. I'm also going to do a recipe in an air fryer. I just ordered a new air fryer which I've heard so many amazing things. You guys actually recommend that I get one for myself because it's supposed to be an easy way for you to cook food fast. It's also supposed to be a healthier option option you know using less oil to get like a crispy finish so I ordered one off of Amazon and it just arrived so I'm super excited to set the thing up and figure it out together and then do like some sweet potato I feel like that would be bomb like some little oof, it even just sounds so good I'm all about healthy eating and meal prep and I feel like this is gonna be the exact thing that I need Boom, I just got this air fryer in the mail straight from Amazon. So shout out to Bagotti for sponsoring today's video. I'm super excited to set this bad boy up and do a fun recipe because I don't know, I just like trying new things. And this is supposed to be a healthier option versus cooking something, frying something in a lot of oil. Plus, it's supposed to cook your food super quick. So I thought I would give you guys a little look of the packaging here that it arrived in. And it has a cookbook inside as well. See, enjoy oilless fried food, 80% less fat intake. We love that. Great for our healthy lifestyle choices. It's always about balance here. Ooh, okay, so I just plugged it in. It's also touch screen. I feel like this is one of the most fancy air fryers I have seen. So here we have a recipe book, which I love. I'm definitely down to try some new things out. And then the instruction manual here. It also has all of the buttons that you will need um, for cooking, you know, certain things like nuggets. We love the nuggets. Fries, I'm definitely gonna use that one today, as well as meats, so fish, poultry, and steak. And I should probably read the manual so I know what the heck I'm going to do. But look at this. Okay, this is also supposed to be dishwasher safe. And I'm gonna rinse this off. And I do have to say, I love how it tells you a time of how long it takes to cook certain things. So today I'm gonna do some sweet potato fries. So it says that I should set it to 360 and it should cook between 18 and 30 minutes. I just washed my sweet potatoes and I think instead of doing like a fry cut, I'm just gonna cube them up so that I can just throw them in the fridge for meal prep today and for the next few days. So these are kind of tiny, which is why I have so many out here. And the basket size on this is pretty hefty, so it's gonna fit perfectly. And I've already watched a lot of like reviews and stuff, so I know not to overcrowd the basket with too much stuff. This way you'll get a really nice crisp finish without having to use oil. So I'm gonna chop these up and then throw them in to my air fryer. I just wanted you guys to hear, it's actually pretty quiet. I don't know what to expect, but that's not bad at all. So I just set my timer for 18 minutes and I threw the sweet potatoes in there at 380. And I'm probably going to flip them, like toss the potatoes over halfway through. been 18 minutes. I'm gonna turn the thing off. Ooh, they smell so good. I wonder if they're done because we all know sweet potatoes take 
forever. Look at that. Oh my God, forever to cook in the oven, like 40 minutes. This took 18 minutes. And they're cooked. Ooh, I have to try. I am shook. I don't even know you could cook a sweet potato that fast. 18 minutes? This would have taken 45 minutes to like 30 minutes in the oven if I baked it. So I'm gonna put these in a meal prep container right now. They taste amazing, they're nice and crispy. I didn't even put that much oil as you guys saw. And they got a nice little bit of color on them on the outside and then they're just like soft and gooey on the inside. So I am super excited about this thing. I can't wait to make other recipes in this. If you have an air fryer, let me know what your favorite thing is to make inside of it. And I'm gonna leave the air fryer that I have that I got from Amazon in the links down below. There's also gonna be a coupon so that you dolls can save exclusively. The coupon is only gonna be available for a little bit of time, so I'll put all the details in the description box below. But I gotta just wanna eat these. Mm, it's hot, hot. Hot, hot, hot. I was definitely not planning on filming a Trader Joe's haul only because it is so late. It's almost nine o'clock and I still wanna get my butt to the gym. But I really took my time today. They weren't crowded or anything and I ended up finding some new stuff and I thought you guys would like to see some of those items that I haven't hauled before on my YouTube channel. Personally, super excited for you know the things that I picked up. So I just stuck with a lot of <laughs> Hold on. What are you doing? You going crazy? You going loco? Malico loco. You just gonna go crazy? Going crazy on the dolls? Yeah, guess what? Mommy got you something fun. You're gonna have to wait and I'm gonna give it to you, okay? Good boy. <laughs> All right, sorry guys, he was going crazy in the background. So you guys know me, I stick to a lot of whole foods. I got a nice little bunch of bananas that are nice and ripe. Um, my potatoes growing eyes, we love that energy. I'm really liking stir fries, so I've been doing a lot of bell pepper, onion, and mushroom. So I got a little onion for that, it adds a lot of flavor to your food. Stocked up on my lemon pepper chicken, I got a balsamic for those nights or lunches that I just want something super simple. I got a nice bag of organic broccoli. This is just a great little green to throw on the side when you feel like you need to get in more greens. Let's see, I got some snack options. Oof, these are so good on the go. If you really just need a little pick-me-up, especially before a workout or a hike, I like to have these because you don't have to have a spoon with them. It's just like a little applesauce in a pouch. So I just got the regular one. I don't know why they're organic, but that's cool. We love a little organic in our life. And then I was about to check out, because you know me, I usually get chips or something, but I think I just didn't really eat the best in Vegas when I was away, so I wanted to stick to more simple foods. So I like having snacks on the go. These are like individually packaged. It's a pistachio cranberry bite with roasted pistachios, dried cranberries, and a little bit of agave. It's gluten-free, and there's six pieces in here. I love nuts and fruit just to snack on in general, so I thought these little bites would be so perfect. And it's funny because I have a nut allergy, but I can eat pistachios and I'm like not dying, you know? Anyone else? Is that weird? I don't know. I feel like that's so weird. And then I've been seeing for a while on Instagram that you can get capsules for the Nespresso machine. I knew they had the K-Cups there and that's what I always saw. So I was looking, I was looking, I was reading the back, like is this compatible with my machine? Sure enough, I came across these. The boxes got a little soggy um, from the drive back, but I'm so excited. They actually have a Lungo, which is comparable to a cup of coffee, right? It's not just an espresso shot. And I don't know what the flavors are gonna be like, but let me tell you, 10 capsules for $3.99 is such a steal. These are even less expensive than the ones that they have at Target stores. And then this one's gonna have like a nice bold flavor to it. This is compatible with this little guy. So I'm so excited, I'm so hyped to have coffee tomorrow. I did stop by Starbucks this night like I went right before Trader Joe's to give me some energy to get through the rest of today I got some purple grapes another great essential snack for me Especially if I have a sweet tooth or something that definitely hits the spot. I got some kombuchas I got the watermelon And I just got like one of each strawberry lemonade, and I love the classic gingerade 
Ooh, yeah, love a good kombucha. It's full of your probiotics, great for your digestion, good gut health, it tastes amazing. For me, I feel like it does give me good skin as well, which is a definite bonus. More snack options. You guys know I live and swear by their coconut milk yogurts. Their coconut milk is disgusting, so I do not recommend that. I actually need to clean my fridge out right now and get rid of stuff that I'm not going to eat and stuff that's gone off. I got some brown rice. I always have this stocked up for that healthy carb. I got four of these organic gala apples. These are my absolute favorite. I had them last time, and oh my gosh, they were so freaking good. So crisp and so sweet. And I like having these with almond butter. And that's just like my snack. Oh my god, I am a snacker, guys. But I don't mind it if it's healthy stuff like, you know, fruit and everything. So that's that. And then I just got two things of steak. And then let's see, we got some avocados. These are almost ready to go. Oof. They're like, eat me. Avocado toast. Put it in my salads. These are the salads that I always get. You could also add chicken to this, black beans if you want to make it vegan or plant-based, just don't eat the cheese with it. I love the dressing, as you guys know. I got Loli some salmon and sweet potato treats. He loves these, they're soft. Um, I don't know, like these just make his breath smell really bad. So I do brush his teeth anyways, like a couple times out of the week, so it doesn't bother me too much. And then I also got him these, these are really good. These are also really affordable at Trader Joe's and I like the ingredients. Look at this, dried chicken breasts, that's it. So I love giving him these type of things, and they're just great when he's been super good, although he's always such a good boy, um, and it keeps him pretty entertained. It's like a very hearty treat. I would say it's like snack time worthy. Okay, he does get snacks, so he loves that. Mushrooms, again, I told you guys I love sauteing them up. They're super simple to even just meal prep a bunch of mushrooms, onions, and bell pepper because it's so versatile, you know, just season it with some olive oil, some pink salt, black pepper. Keep it super simple. You can throw it in your eggs in the morning if you're doing an omelet. You can do it with your protein of choice. If you want to add a carb to it, go for it. Like, it's just such a great little side, and I, I feel like it has so much flavor than just broccoli. You feel me? And I just got another little salad kit. Oh, yeah. You guys saw in one of my vlogs. I tried these on camera and I love them. I love the ginger. It's not overwhelming. So I got two of these for this week and those are $1.99 each. I also like having some sparkling water on hand as well from time to time if I'm just sick of boring water, which is not often for me because your girl loves to be hydrated. And then just for those nights when I need to relax, I wanted to try a different wine solely because this label was so cute. And it's called Rain Cloud. It's a red wine, so I'm assuming it's just a blend, a California blend. Didn't really tell me much about the notes on the back. Personally, I'm more of like a oaky wine, so I love a good Cabernet. Uh, but this one definitely caught my eye today, so I'm excited to try that out this week. But that's my little haul. I'm going to put everything away after I clean out the fridge. But I'm super excited for the capsules that I showed you guys. Oof. These. So I'm going to let you guys know in like a what I eat in a day video how those are. Ooh, this lighting is not it. Ooh, look what mommy got the baby.